It's Cameron Grady from Premier Property, and I'm joined by Steve Matthews here from Shawbrook Bank. Uh, hi, Steve. How are you doing? You all yeah, right? good. Thank you. Good. So we've just been at uh, Knightsbridge uh, here, and we've uh, just uh, been on a panel. Uh, fantastic evening, developer panel, panel. Over a hundred people in the room. Yep. Do you enjoy it, Steve? Yeah, it's a big vibe. Lots of good questions coming back, and uh, nothing to call me out too bad. Brilliant. So we've got some um, more questions for you. Okay. Uh, for the people watching this, the listeners here. So, Shawbrook Bank, now we hear, we've heard a lot about it, it's one of the top banks in the UK. Uh, what would you say sets you apart from other banks that are out there that are lending? Yeah, it's, it's, it's a good question. Shawbrook launched in 2011 in a difficult time, as we all know, with the economy and with a clear strategy to support seasoned property investors. So we've got a very clear strategy of the people we can lend to. Um, we've designed and constantly develop our product set to move with the times of the market, come to events like this to understand what you know, the end consumer is actually looking for. So we talked about development tonight and understood a lot about what they want. Uh, we talk about term finance and again understand what the needs are. So a big thing about Shawbrook as a commercial bank is not so much a description in commercial what we lend on, but it's our ability to change with the times, uh, listen to the feedback we're getting and, and be commercial and pragmatic in the decisions we make. Okay, so people that are listening in, um, there's a lot of investors out there who are interested in developments, they're, they're interested in getting lending quickly for their projects. Yeah. Um, there's some fantastic projects out there right now. So what would you say to assist uh, the investors out there where they're actually looking to deal with a bank and get those uh, mortgage offers through very quickly, yeah. how can they assist you to make a decision quickly? What uh, do you think are the key factors that they should really be considering just to make sure that they're helping themselves to, to get that finance? Sure. It's, it's, it's some really basic stuff. So mm -hmm. it comes down to you know, protect your, yourself personally, protect your credit file, don't make any stupid mistakes on there that are going to cause problems or confusions for the bank. Be organised, and if a bank's asking for documentation to support the application, be prepared to give it. You know, banks aren't going to make a, a lending decision on the back of a simple application. They're going to want some kind of evidence. Shawbrook distribute purely through mortgage brokers, and the broker will always give the client the best advice. Hopefully, Shawbrook, but could be another lender. But we'll be clear with the broker as to what we want to support an application. Okay. Be honest with the broker. Tell them what you're doing broker can disclose all of that to us and we'll make a decision based on that information that we're given. It's not done to rip mm. That's a very valid point uh, you brought up there Steve. So people tend to sometimes um, take information and not give the full information. Where yes, when um, I mean, you give the full information to a mortgage broker, actually people with any, any kind of adverse, they put it right at the front of their file to show that, okay, that's the situation that they're in. Yeah. Um, absolutely, you know, you can help them better, can't you? Deal that's with it up front. It's, 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 it doesn't have to be a no, and if you hide it, it probably end up, will end up being a no. So get anything you've got uh, that concerns you, deal with it up front, mm. tell us what it is, and, and we'll be honest in our feedback with it. Mm, that's good advice. And in terms of products right now in the market, um, yeah. what are you finding in the market that... You know, where you think that you fit in with a uh, fantastic product, maybe where other banks aren't really uh, doing it as well as you are at Shawbrook. Yeah, I think there's probably two key areas that spring to mind. We've been uh, talking this evening a lot about development, but Shawbrook's space development's a broad topic. A lot of what we do is around refurbishment, so we've definitely got some of the most competitive pricing out there in the market in terms of what we can do. Um, we, we have the facilities to lend quite you know, sizable loans on them, and we will deliver them quickly. Okay, can you give us some figures? Uh, kind of yeah, so I mean, if you're looking to do the, the light refurb, which is probably one of our most popular products, take a residential asset, for example, uh, the works would be non-structural, so kitchen, bathroom, that kind of stuff. If we're looking to lend at 70%, it's 0.73% per month. And that's interest can be rolled up, can be retained, um, or it, you know, it can be serviced. So no, uh, no early payment charges at the end of it, and it's probably one of our most popular products. That's interesting. So 0.73, if I heard you correctly, 0.73% per month, uh, no uh, early redemption uh, penalties, that's which right. is brilliant. So yeah. if you're looking at uh, flipping properties, works fabulously yeah. well. Yeah. Um, and if you're like me, it's all about making sure the deal really works right from the beginning, right from the day before you buy that property and acquire and actually decide to do anything with it. It's about making sure the numbers work. Uh, crucial that we get the numbers right. And absolutely, you know, banks, you, uh, Shawbrook, uh, you'll be looking at the numbers right, right from the beginning. Yeah, the numbers have to work out. So the, the probably common bit of feedback I get will only ever lend to clients that are experienced in the field they want to come to me. Yeah. To talk about short term finance and a light reef, uh, mm. they say how hard is it to put in a kitchen or a bathroom? Mm. The answer is not hard to put in a kitchen or a bathroom, but to buy well, 
to spend the right amount of money on the refurb and to sell at the right price. That's the skill of the investor and that's the experience we're looking for. Mm. So don't go into a, you know, a project with a paddle at an auction and pay over the ceiling price of the street because we won't want to support the deal and the deal won't work for the client. Mm. No, you think it's no, that makes sense. I mean, um, so this is what we have here at Premier Property Club. We have key experts just like Steve who come along and they share their knowledge and their experience and they're very open actually about what, you know, what they can do for you and how you can help yourself um, to really move forward in your journey.